I know what you're thinking. You know what it means. I knew it's interesting for bad people to get theirs. The sense of feel of righteousness, watching Hollywood, celebrities, and politicians. We have it. Well, Jesus Christ is risen for all the people caught in scandals. You better find out what it is. It's up for grabs. Next. Somebody's gotta say it. This is the final quality time kind of video commentary thoughts. Over the weekend. Okay, uh, over Easter weekend while I was gone. Presented. And I uh, want you to know that i back for an all-new Final Closing Time Factor video commentary thoughts. And it could be the big finale uh, starting on um, April 29th because I, can, cause I forgot to do it. Trust me about that. So it'll be a big one. Trust me about that. Now, in this Easter season, I have been thinking about the importance of redemption over the years by virtue circulation in political circles as far as we concern circles concern and um, and I know have known personal personally some people involved in public scandals the world watches as the media except Obama or George Soros and then relentless for Days and weeks and months, and then evaporates and leaves, leaves behind the scenes of a complete uh, and utter self-inflicted impersonal destructions. Well, some of these folks know that are distraught to the point of suicidal. Now, what does the camera doesn't show? It happens. And uh, after the hoopla dies down, and sometimes these folks turn inward and become bitter and uh, permanently broken, but not always. Well, the untold stories are the others, and this is why are the healing and saving grace. You know, I have a privilege to everyone, not long into that through their eyes, of everyone of them. And recently, the object of a very public humiliation, as I spoke to um, many acts of love, many acts of love and compassion to their families. So, and members of this local congregation have come forward in technical ways, but I, uh, sharing the, um, the brokenness and the healing of Christ's forgiveness and restoration. For as for me, I know. Christian Episcop uh, I'm a Christian Episcopalian conservative. Goes to my church. Goes to my church and sing on Sunday mornings. And no one likes to have their mistakes, but when they're viewed a content of sin, sin atones by Christ's sacrifice on the cross, then they become only the final chapter of the story of victory and healing, not the last chapter. In most cases, the final story, which would be the big season finale of my Time Factor website, starts uh, this Friday. Friday, as far as we're concerned. Because I'm, I'm, I'm on a sabbatical leave, so don't worry, I'll be back. Season number six, Supper Grabs. This is why I'm so, this is why I'm so shocked. Distaste by the fact that my dear friend and dear friend and mentor Chuck Colson served time in prison. And you might think that I was laugh at and stared at a land of confusion. Give me a break. This is serious for God's sakes. Take this advantage. A teachable moment when we were then able to point out that Colson's disgrace led him to the foot of a foot of the cross. And from there, he has has one of the one of the greatest Christian heroes of all time. And without brokenness, Colson had never become the man of God. 
and has usually ministered to literally millions of people, many of whom are and were in prison. You might think they're called grace, that, that's called grace, and the crux of this Easter story. See this, many Christians believe that Christ is the Son of God, died specifically not the righteous, but the sinner. But who's, who's the sinner? Well, all of us, every one single one of us has been unkind, lied, disobedient. Yes, it all counts. He had the only sinless man was ever born. He stepped to take the punishment and in the process of conquering sin, the ultimate death, he rose to new life indeed. Through his atonement, offers a clean slate before a holy God, and that that's what Easter is all about. And I know there's a sense of, this is like I said, the Hollywood, Hollywood elites have self-righteousness watching this, and the political failures are crashing down. Bad, uh, you know, why? It's, it's because of bad choices and dishonesty. But we need to remember that. All have sinned and fall short of the glory of God, and I stand constantly to humans, for, for other broken, broken humans in the in the this thing, who claim Christ sacrificed. He is risen for all the people, caught in scandals, and for those who stand were never caught, and for those who are plainly broken. I, like uh, like the Apostle Paul, standing with the sinners, who, and who I am, the chief. Well, guess what? The moral story is that Jesus Christ on, is on the cross, took the punishment, and I deserve for my sins. Now, because of his resurrection, I stand forgive by his grace, and he will do the same for you as he died for other sinners just like us. He is risen indeed. So there. That's my story. I'm sticking to it. Anyways, don't forget to uh, check my website at lhmusictimefactor.weebly.com for my uh, final closing time factor, oh yeah, my time factor website. And of course, of course, you know who my final closing time factor video commentary thoughts from YouTube, Ustream.tv, TV, TV, and Facebook. At a uh, final final closing time factor video commentary thoughts. dot dot com. So I'm gonna do this this summer. Trust me about that. So, indeed, I say more, more. So, uh, say more. Trust me about that. And, um, who knows? Don't forget tomorrow. Four more episodes. Trust me about that. Anyways, I really gotta go. Till we, till we, till, till we meet again. LH Music America's Love Festival. Christian Conservative is signing off, and we will be the real conservative key for the real conservative dancers. And I gotta go. I gotta brush my teeth. Go with God's blessings. Bye bye for now. So, lights out. If you don't mind. Time back, time. Angel Song and Mercury. Don't forget to Facebook me and follow me at facebook.com slash LHMusicTime as well as twitter.com slash LHMusicTime. You'd be glad you did. <laughs>